Tesla's electric cars require far less maintenance than gas-powered cars. Here are all of the differences between them discussed by business insiders. Welcome back, dear Torque News friends. This is Armen Harayan from torquenews.com. Please subscribe to our channel, like this video, and enable the notification bell because later today I'm going to bring you more interesting Tesla stories so you can see them and not miss them. And let's discuss them in the comment section below. So Business Insider reports that traditional cars come with elaborate maintenance schedules that require owners to develop a close relationship relationship with dealers and mechanics. Tesla vehicles are mechanically simpler than gas-powered cars. As a result, they require less attention. Tesla also routinely improves its vehicles using over-the-air software updates, and we're going to talk a lot about all these uh, maintenance requirements. But still, there are some areas of maintenance that Tesla owners need to keep an eye on. What are those uh, maintenances and how they measure against the gas-powered car maintenances? There is really no debate. Electric cars are much easier and less costly to maintain than gas-powered cars, writes Business Insiders, the link of which I will put in the description of this video for you to see. Tesla makes another by electric, uh, actually Tesla makes nothing by electric cars, so its owners can say goodbye forever to oil changes and various other common gas drivetrain maintenance responsibilities. In many ways, all Tesla owners need to do is wash their cars regularly and wait around for net the next over-the-air software updates to keep vehicles in tip-top condition. Tesla owners do need to pay attention to a few important maintenance issues, however. Eventually, electric vehicle batteries have to be replaced. They can only manage so many charge cycles. And Tesla has not reinvented the good old-fashioned tire at least not a year, uh, at least not yet. Here is a rundown allow, uh, of all the ways that keeping a Tesla on the road is different from a gas-powered vehicles. First, oil changes. It's a way of life for owners of traditional gas-powered vehicles. Every few thousand miles, manufacturers recommend changing the engine oil and oil filters. Some owners are scrupulous about schedule. Some just do it twice a year. Teslas have no engine oil, so their owners don't even have to think about charging it. I had a friend, a um, wonderful man, who owned, uh, uh, who owned a large uh, set of uh, dealerships. He, he told me, Armin, if you change your car's oil religiously, they will run almost forever. So, but Teslas have no engine oil, so their owners don't even have to think about changing it. Second, assorted fluids. Traditional cars have plenty of other fluids besides engine oil to keep an eye on, and so do Teslas. For example, Tesla's simple transmission requires infrequently a filter change and door hinges still need to be lubricated, but on balance, the electric drivetrain is almost fluid-free. Third, fuel additives. These compounds added to gas tanks to clean engine parts are controversial, but some owners swear by them. Teslas require uh, only electricity, however, so that's one less thing for an owner to worry about. Next, engine computer updates. For most traditional cars, an upgrade to the engine control unit means a trip to a dealer or authorized technician. That's slowly changing though, with new cars coming. With Teslas, most software tweaks are handled via over-the-air upgrades. Next one. Semi-self-driving upgrades. Tesla's autopilot system has been continually improved for many vehicles through over-the-air software upgrades rather than through hardware improvements. Next one. Easter eggs. Every time Tesla updates software, it usually throws uh, in a few what they call Easter eggs. It has nothing to do with Easter for funds such as the Rainbow Bridge, a reference to Mario Kart. Next, performance upgrades. 
Again, by using over-the-air software updates, Tesla can unlock additional performance from an owner's vehicle. There are some limitations due to the vehicle age and drivetrains, but for a traditional car, enhancing performance often means bringing a mechanic into the process. Next, battery replacement. Tesla hasn't been around long enough to require replacement of their largest and most expensive component, the battery. However, this is where gas-powered vehicles have a slight advantage. A new Tesla battery could cost between $5,000 to $7,000, while a new gas tank is about $1,000. A whole new motor, however, could be more than $3,000. Next, tires. When it comes to tires, Teslas are just like all other vehicles as far as the rubber hitting the road. For new premium tires could run $1,000 before installation costs. Next, brakes. On traditional cars, brake pads need to be changed every 50,000 miles, and sometimes sooner. Brake rotors also need to be replaced. But because Tesla uses regenerative braking, pads and rotors are subjected to less wear. Owners can expect to change pads more like every 100,000 miles. Next, bodywork. For the Tesla Model S and Model X, aluminum body construction means that accidents can get expensive. The Model 3 and Model Y vehicles should be cheaper to replace. Next, interior. Over time, most car interiors start to show their age. Tesla's much coveted white interior is likely to suffer this process. However, I routinely check out interiors on older Teslas and I've yet to find one that looks really bad, writes the uh, uh, author of this story in Business Insider. I think this is thanks to the combination of quality and owner obs um, obsessiveness. Next, components. Tesla owners can't escape minor repairs such as replacing aging headlights, or worn out suspension, um, suspension parts. Next, legacy design issues. Teslas are generally beloved by owners, but some vehicles suffer from engineering missteps. The Tesla Model X's Falcon wings doors, wing doors, for instance, are rather complicated. So legacy design issues are another issue for people to to do when they're looking at maintaining their Teslas. Next is the, the self-presenting door handles on early Model S vehicles cause problems. Tesla has also undertaken several recalls, although not many on balance. The next one is running out of gas. It doesn't happen much these days, but in a gas-powered vehicle, a call to a roadside assistance service gets you a few gallons in relatively short order. With a Tesla, however, fully depleting the battery means potentially hour upon hour of recharging depending on access to level 1, level 2 or DC fast charging locations. So make sure you never run out of battery and plan your trips when you drive a Tesla or a, a, another electric car. The next one is actually the towing. Just like a gas-powered vehicle, if a Tesla won't budge, a call to a towing service is unavoidable. So whether you are a, driving a Tesla or another electric car or a gas car, if it doesn't budge, a call to a towing service is unavoidable. Well, these are some of the things that I wanted to discuss with you, written in that story by, uh, published by Business Insider and written by Matthew DeBord. So please subscribe to our channel, like this video to show your appreciation of Matthew's hard work comparing uh, uh, the maintenance required for Tesla owners 
versus the maintenance of uh, that is required by gas car owners. Um, if you are a Tesla owner or gas car owner, I would like to hear from you in the comment section. Uh, let us discuss your maintenance questions or maintenance issues. If you are a Tesla owner, uh, did some of these maintenance issues resonate with you? Or w w are there any other maintenance topics that were not discussed here? Please write about them in the comment section below. Let's discuss them there. And I uh, thank you very much for listening and watching. You have a wonderful day. Please uh, subscribe to our channel, ring the notification bell. And if you would like to know what we're going to cover later, please look at our uh, YouTube channel's community page and also visit us at torquenews.com. Have a wonderful day. Stay safe and God bless you all.